Ooh, I don't have enough money. Time to return to Bree and get small change for all my weapons. See, because you know the guy in the bar, he he wants to stock up armor f or armor and weapons for the um for the in impending doom. Welcome. I think more folks are starting to believe the dangers I warned of are real. But it's no wonder, really. What with the Black Riders appearing on our streets and attempted murder right here in the inn. You've been very helpful. I think we have a good store of arms now. I know you haven't helped us for the money, so I want to show you my appreciation. I found this amulet many years ago on the Barrow Downs. I've always suspected it has some special virtue. Maybe it will be of use to you. Good luck. What did it give me? Choice of reward. Find the box in the inventory used to choose your reward, but why can't you just give me the reward straight off the bat? Stupid. Oh, they just have a lot of value. Well, that's nice. All right, lady, let's go. Oh, that was the end. Okay. Well. We've reached the top of the wall. Now to find and destroy the war machines. And quickly, Velarom is in danger. On the edge. It's a long way down. Man, it took off his whole leg. It, what cracks me up is it's like the staff is is uh, cutting people up, and the staff obviously has no ledge, edge to it. But it's like whatever. All right, let's do it. Excuse me, man. Stop standing in my way. All right. Look around real quick just to make sure. Nah, I'm fine. An 
Oh, I still gotta charge down on that. Fuck it, I'll do it myself. Back, Farin. I got this. Get out of here. Oh, he's just showing up to show up. Well done. I am free to fly unhindered. But there are others fighting in the city. They may need our help. Could it be Elrond's sons? I cannot say. But they move with stealth, and they leave a trail of slain enemies in their wake. That sounds like Eladan and Elro here on both accounts. They are likely heading for the Citadel, just as we are. Then let's push on. Maybe we'll meet up with them. I will shadow your movements from above. In open ground, I can strike against our foes. Call on me when the need is great. All right. I have to remember to call on him more. That's pretty dope. That couldn't do it.
What's this? They have a power bomb on the Ouch. That was a bad idea. I should have called the bird. What's he doing anyway?
Hmm. What is this new quest they're talking about? Oh. All right, let's see what we got. All right, let's uh, back slowly out of this situation. Guess that was it. I shall proceed. Someone's coming. Besting a troll in combat? That is no small feat, friends. It would appear that we are on the same side. Perhaps we could be of assistance to each other. Allow us to offer a hand. Andriel, is that you? Well met, my friends. We were told we might find you here. I am truly glad to see you. Allow me to introduce my companions, Eridan of the Dunedain and Farin of Erebor. I present to you Eladan and Elrohir, the sons of Elrond Half-Elven. It is a pleasure to make the acquaintance of such skilled and courageous warriors. Was it the three of you, then, who freed the Great Eagle? Yes, Velarom is his name. That was well done. But what brings you to Fornost? That's, uh... I'm willing to guess that's, uh, Cam Clark, the, uh, voice of, um... Uh, I hope that is Cam Clark. The voice of, um... Of, uh... Oh, what's his name? The Sand Dude from Naruto. Gara. Uh, it sounds like him. And also... I mean, he does a bunch of voice actor jobs. He's not 
he's not as prolific as Steve Blum in these video games. He certainly is, though. He's He's got voices everywhere. Steve Blum, you see a lot in anime. Cam Clark, you, you hear a lot in, in video games for sure. Like, especially voiceovers from anime, which is interesting. Anyway, Ake, Akihiko. We are here at the request of Aragorn. But why would Aragorn send you to Fornost? Has he learned of the goblin force gathered here? It's bigger than just a gathering of goblins. We were with the rangers at Sarn Ford when we were attacked by Black Riders out of Mordor. That is grim news. But it does not explain why Aragorn would send you here. The Black Riders are in league with a man called Agandar. It is he who commands this force. I begin to understand. Aragorn wishes you to distract Agandar. Aye, you've got the right of it. But now that we have joined forces, we can do more than distract him. Let us cut the head from this serpent of Sauron. You know what? I, I kind of wish somebody would show up and be like, we heard your story from this other person. And then we just move to the next part, you know. Uh, everybody these people come in contact with, they have to explain who Agandaur is and all that stuff. My understanding was he was a, a king, right? He was a king. And now he works for Sauron. So it's like, yeah, uh, one of the Black Riders, Agandaur, is causing trouble. Everybody should be like, oh, yeah, 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 I get it. I get it. <laughs> we got to stop him. Because, I mean, that's the type of villainy they have. There's no nuance in the villains, you know what I mean? <coughs> they work for Sauron. Sauron's a bad person. Because reasons. Because fire. Because eye in the sky. Because a uh, ring. You know, all of that stuff. And, um... You know, there, there's no backstory for Sauron. Might be. I don't know it. Because they don't talk about that. I don't talk about any of the uh, other lore that could be happening in the story. We're just trying to do a side story off this lore where they're going after a bad guy who who is Sauron's bad guy. But the story has done absolutely nothing to establish what a bad person he is but talk about it, you know? And that, I mean, they did in the very first scene of the game where, where the... Um, Rangers were fighting the riders, and then they lost. And that's bad for the economy, I guess. <laughs> I don't know. One thing's for sure. If they're, if they're allowed to run roughshod around the area, then, then you know, it's, it's uh, good for everybody on the planet Earth. However they do it, even though, I mean, we're talking about the king's ruling people and stuff. I don't know. So, sounds like a case of old boss meet the new boss type of thing. They had to birth orcs out of the ground instead of, instead of you know, having orcs with children. Like having uh, people, like female orcs get with male orcs and have kids. None of that stuff. They pulled them out of the mud. And that's why I have this this unstoppable force from a, a factory and we gotta kill them all as people who were born and raised and done things that's the difference they make their people and we make our people slower and you know just as disgusting though Pull, pulling pulling um a baby out of a woman it's probably just as disgusting, if not more, than pulling a orc out of the mud. But <laughs> at least the babies look cuter. And that's how we choose who our heroes are in this game. Who's cute? Who's ugly as hell? I'm siding with the cute people because they look more like... Well, not like me. I'm black. They look more like my wife. <laughs> <laughs> Yay. <laughs> Lord of the Rings. Anyway. Agreed. But first, we must find him. 
He is certain to be in the Citadel at the heart of the city. We must attempt to make our way there. No easy task amid these crumbling ruins, and a host of orcs and goblins will seek to bar our way. If we are separated, press on toward the Citadel. There we will regroup for our final attack. Very well. Let us begin. Alright, let's head to the Citadel. Find a route. Oh, that's what... Oh, okay. So which is it? Do you want us to stay closer? Oh, you will. Okay, good. When when were you planning on doing that? Cuz we've kind of got to um would you get out of my way? Kind of got a eagle that does that thing. I don't know. Although, I don't think we needed the eagle that much, did we? Prepare yourselves. Goblins attack! <clears throat> Alright. Okay, come on. We're preparing ourselves. Doesn't seem like as much of a goblin attack, though. And goblin, you take a lot of hits. Yay. The ruins are a maze of streets and pathways. We will search this way while you three try another route. We will meet at the citadel, if not before. You don't want to kill bad guys? There, at the far end of this passage. Oh. They left a little early, didn't they? I hit him. Which wall? Oh, those walls that we were just pointing at? I feel like there's a bug crawling down my ear, but I can't stop now. I can check the bug. There's another guy there. Oh, excuse me, sir. Yeesh. All right, back to work. Farn has fallen. Come on, dwarf. 
There are still foes to defeat. Many thanks. Let's get back to it. You guys can come back now. How do you tell if they're blocking? How do you tell if they're blocking your shit if, um... <clears throat> if, you, if you don't have the numbers on? <laughs> 